he's not. <laughs> he's not. I wouldn't have married a man if he was different. You have found what I hoped you would find in a man. Absolutely considerate, she's thoughtful, she's always doing things for me and making sure that I'm okay, which is, I mean, the best feeling. It makes you feel like a king, and she's my queen, so it's perfect. Oh my God. Her inner beauty yeah, outweighs her exterior beauty by, by a landslide. You have uncovered someone who can get you as high as you want to go. And he has been a trailblazer. He's, he's done so many things that I'm like, wow, you really made that happen. I admire that a lot about him. It takes, it takes a lot to do some of the things that he's done. And it makes me want to be better. Kareem is everything that I ever wanted one of my daughters to have. She's like my best friend, so no reason for you to go home anymore, so I gotta marry you to keep you in. She's, she's the one. Rejoicing in the marriage of Morgan and Kareem, we pass the peace of Christ, the peace of the Lord. We always with you. I love you, I toast you, I wish you all the world of happiness. You the best, man. I love you, Morgan. I love you, Kareem. <clears throat> wasn't looking for a boyfriend. She wasn't looking for a relationship, whatever that meant. But... Being persistent pays off. It was right when I decided I was going to the University of Miami. So probably like May, like right after graduation, and I get a text from this girl that we both knew apparently. She's like, oh, well, I know this guy that's going there who's also from Atlanta. You should find him on Facebook.